Folks, your next comic coming to the stage is the Mary Kate to my Ashley. Please put your hands together for Lee Hinton. How y'all doing? I'm doing pretty good. I barely made it up those steps. Woo! I was sweating. I was sweating like Mike Tyson on Jet. And when I got to the top, a white guy came up to me. He said, hey, brother. I was like, hey, brother. Mama never told me about you. I said, well, if you're my brother, can I get you the co-sign? I jumped on the scale this morning, and I weighed 360 pounds. So I'm thinking, if I work real hard and eat the right kind of food, I can make it all the way to 400. <laughs> I'm like the little, little thing like 40 pounds keep me from my goal, people. Ugh. Well, I'm from Raleigh, North Carolina. You made it out. <laughs> and I don't know about you guys here in the West, but we got little sayings that, that mean something in the South. You know, like, if your hand is itching, that means you're going to get some money. Mm -hmm. And if your ear is itching, that means somebody's talking about you. And if your ass is itching, <laughs> Herpes. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> when I, you're still laughing. <laughs> when I first came out here to the West Coast, everybody was just so nice. And I found out why. They were high. <laughs> Then I found out that the weed was so good here in Portland, it'll make you want to get a job. <laughs> For real. You know, some people say that pot will lead to stronger drugs. I say pot will lead you to Popeyes. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I found out, because I've been here, there's two things that you Portlanders, Oregonians love the most. And that's weed and dogs. <laughs> mm -hmm. Now, if you got a dog, you can walk your da dog down through the waterfront, through all this greener when we got here. If you got some weed, you can smoke it, make a friend, enlighten your mind, be social. But if you got a dog that smokes weed, <laughs> you can get laid. <laughs> but today was a beautiful day. Today was a good day. I went to McDonald's, and I ate a Big Mac. And 15 minutes later, I cracked a quarter pounder. <laughs> but up, 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 up. <laughs> I'm loving it. There you go. Then you know, they say, keep Portland weird. You guys are doing a real good job. <laughs> I went to a vegan barbecue. Mm -hmm. A vegan barbecue. That's right, lady. The food was delicious. I brought my own. <laughs> I am. Um, I got severe dry skin, and the doctor told me to use olive oil. 
So now when I go out to the clubs, I smell like Olive Garden. <laughs> and all the vegetarian women are coming up to me, and boy, do they look hungry. <laughs> so I keep some croutons in my pocket. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm making it rain on those girls. <laughs> making it rain! Uh-huh, yes, yeah, nice to meet you too, lady. I see you looking at that bulge in my pocket. That's not what you think it is. That's a breadstick. <laughs> I've been hearing a lot of people here in Portland talk about white guilt. You just got real quiet. <laughs> <laughs> and the only thing I can say about white guilt is, it works for me. <laughs> mm -hmm. If you want to buy me some ice cream, the healing can begin. My name is Lee Henson. Thank you. One more time for Lee Henson, everybody. Folks,